right, let's go over the new top five fastest killing guns in ranked play after the season three update. Multiple weapons receive buffs as well as nerfs. All setups have changed. So if you guys wanna stay up to date, make sure you drop a like on the video, subscribe to the channel, and turn those post notifications. Let's get right into it. So first off, we're taking a look at the Bass P, which received a buff, and now you can challenge the Vazdev 9K with this submachine gun. For the first attachment, we are gonna use the Bruin Flash Grip to increase that sprint to fire speed as well as aim down sight speed. Definitely a fantastic attachment on this newly buffed SMG to go ahead and shake up the meta. For the stock, we are gonna rock the Bruin Flash V4 stock. This is fantastic, bumping up that sprint speed, aim walking speed, crouch movement speed, as well as aim down sight speed. This is gonna be a mandatory attachment if you guys are trying to outgun Vaznev 9K players at those close ranges. We are not running an optic on this setup. We are not running a barrel on this setup, but we are gonna go ahead and run the Bruin Pendulum Muzzle to bump up that vertical as well as horizontal recoil control. This is gonna be a great attachment to go ahead and keep the recoil down, and it's not gonna add that much aim down sight speed, which is gonna be super important, again, when trying to outgun Vaznev players. And then finally, for the underbarrel, we are gonna rock that FSS Shark Fin 90. Definitely a great attachment here to smooth out that recoil pattern and again, not increasing the aim down sight speed. Once you go into the firing range, you're gonna be very happy because this class setup is going to have a quick ADS. And like all of my builds, it's gonna have very controllable recoil. And that's gonna be very important when trying to attack people still running the Vaznev 9k nothing wrong with that but we definitely want to switch up the meta a little bit now for the manner of the setup we are going to be rocking the x12 the attachments are relevant sun grenade simtex and for the perks double time bomb squad as well as fast hands and I like to go ahead and have undead silence because everybody and their mom is running the trophy system good to use if you're trying to flank some spawn points or go ahead and bust a hill in a rotation now for class setup number two we are taking a look at the vasnev 9k it's nice to have this setup on deck because some matches you're gonna have to bust it out plain and simple so for the attachments we are gonna rock the true tech grip to increase that sprint to fire speed as well as aim down sight speed and mandatory attachment on the submachine gun so we have a fast ads get that first shot and guarantee us that kill now for the stock, we are gonna rock the Otrazat stock. I personally love this stock on the Vaznev, increasing that aim walking speed as well as sprint speed. Now, if you want to, you can run the broadside FCT for increased aiming stability, crouch movement speed, aim down sight speed, and sprint speed. But I believe the Otrazat stock is gonna be a better attachment for this specific loadout, which is gonna allow us to have little to no recoil. We are not running an optic because the iron tights are literally crystal clear on the submachine gun. We're not running a barrel here. This is going to be unnecessary, but we are going to rock a muzzle, which is going to be that Spyro V3.5 flash hider. This is a new attachment a lot of the pro players are running, and it is very good, allowing us to have muzzle flash concealment as well as recoil steadiness, overall making the ease of the use of the weapon drastically increased. Now, for the underbarrel, we are going to rock the Commando Foregrip here. This is going to be for more aim out of stability as well as stabilization, smoothing out that recoil pattern. If you don't need additional recoil control, you can put on, if you guys go over all the way over here, you can put on the FSS Sharkfin 90 on this attachment. Definitely a good option here, but again, for my personal uses, I like to have setups that literally don't move. Recoil control is something I don't want to worry about when playing ranked play. And once you go ahead and jump into the firing range, you're going to find out that this class setup has a quick ADS. And I mean, look, there literally is zero recoil, and that's the best way to rock these ranked play builds. Now, in the setup, we are going to be rocking X12, Sun Grenade, Semtex, and for the perks we have on Double Time Bomb Squad, fast hands as well as dead silence for setup number three we are taking a look at the cast off 545 this is going to be another build that's going to be based around literally zero recoil because again i'm not trying to control recoil in ranked play for the setup we are rocking that true tech grip again a great option here sprint to fire speed as well as aim down sight speed we are rocking the broadside fct on this build bumping up that crouch movement speed sprint speed aim down sight speed as well as aiming stability everything we need on the 545 to turn into a monster we have it covered with this attachment 
we are not running an optic the iron sights literally are crystal clear all of the cast off vasnev builds don't need optics at all we're not running a barrel these are going to be completely irrelevant but we are going to rock a multi which is going to be that full chrome pro definitely a great option bumping up that vertical as well as horizontal recoil you're going to see why this is such a good attachment and then for the underbarrel, we are going to rock that shark fin 90 a great attachment here smoothing out that recoil pattern and we're not going to have any cons and we're going to have a quick ads again you're going to see that once you jump in the firing range and then finally we are going to be rocking that high velocity ammo for that increased bullet velocity to bump up that hit registration so we can make sure we are hitting our shots fast down range and getting those kills once you go ahead and jump in the firing range again you're gonna be very happy here because this is a very quick ads almost as fast as that vasnev and again like all my builds here in rank play the recoil control is going to be very easy to handle because that's what you want to have with all of these rank play setups man the build again x12 sun grenade simtex and for the perk double time bomb squad fast hands and dead silence now setup number four we're going to take a look at the lockman sub personally i love running off meta weapons the lockman sub is a fast ttk at close range the vasnev 9k is easy to use but again it's nice to go ahead and shake some things up but the lockman sub we are rocking that chronos script to increase that flinch resistance it's going to be a good attachment here again so we can get into the spawn we can go ahead and push enemies with the vasnev and win here so definitely keeping our shots on target definitely a huge plus for the stock, we are going to rock that mobile stock. Another great attachment on the submachine gun, bumping up the aiming stability, crouch movement speed, as well as aim down sight speed. You're going to love this attachment on the submachine gun. We're not running an optic. The iron tights are crystal clear. Thank God. For the barrel, we are going to rock that Falcon 226 millimeter barrel for bumping up the movement speed and aim down sight speed. And then we can go ahead and increase the mobility. We're definitely going to do that on the submachine gun. Again, we are going to be attacking Vaznev 9k players and for the muzzle we are going to rock the spiral v3 flash hider a fantastic attachment on the lockman sub to increase that muzzle flash concealment as well as recoil steadiness here you're going to see in the firing range why this is so helpful on the submachine gun and then finally for the underbarrel we are going to rock the shark fin 90 to smooth out that recoil pattern overall giving us a little bit easier of a submachine gun to use now once you go into the firing range again you're gonna be very happy because like all my setups quick ads and you guys can see here very controllable recoil definitely a good setup to attack vasnev 9k players with manner of the build is going to be the x12 sun grenade simtex as well as the perk setup for double time bomb squad fast hands and dead silence now for setup number five this is going to be our fallback this is going to be the tac 56 the tac 56 and the vasnev 9k are two important classes to have at your disposal at all times just in case you have to bring them out now for the tac 56 we are going to rock the demo clean shot grip to increase that sprint to fire speed as well as aim down sight speed getting that first shot with this weapon is going to guarantee you that kill at those medium ranges with this specific loadout now for the stock we are going to rock the tv cardinal stock some people like to go ahead and put on the x line pro personally i'm not a fan of this you're gonna have a lot more recoil and again here in ranked play you don't want that to happen you're gonna have increased aim walking stability and sprint speed everything we need to go ahead and move from position to position and still maintain on target now for the optic we're gonna be skipping over this we don't need this for this loadout the iron tights are crystal clear and good enough for the barrel we are gonna rock that 17.5 inch tundra pro barrel this is gonna be a mandatory attachment here in ranked play and if you do not have this on and somebody you're trying to get in a gunfight with does you are going to lose those mid-range engagements this is going to bump up that damage range hit fire accuracy as a nice bonus as well as bullet velocity now for the muzzle we are going to rock the full come pro definitely a great option here increasing that vertical as well as horizontal recoil and you're going to see why this is so helpful in the firing range and then finally we are going to rock the fss shark fin 90 definitely a great attachment again moving out recoil pattern and offering no cons once you go ahead and get in the firing range again like all my setups guys quick ads incredibly easy to use at range little to no recoil at all Mainer of the build is me the x12 7 grenade semtex as well as obviously double time bomb squad fast hands and dead silence this is definitely a fantastic step to have at your disposal at all times these are going to be the top five fastest killing guns here in ranked play in season three. Now, if there are two sets, I want you guys to check out just to go ahead and mix up 
the meta definitely give the bash p a go it's a solid submachine gun and also give the cast off 545 a go but if you guys get into a lobby that is a little bit harder than usual and everybody's running vasnev and type 56 obviously you have these setups at your disposal been your ears and if you guys enjoy drop a like on the video subscribe to the channel turn those notifications and i'm gonna catch you guys in the next one y'all deuces